ain't here. I'll wait then. Yes, sir. Doesn't that scare them? No, sir. They're used to it. Is that the only weapon you have, son? David used it. Where did he kill a lion and 50 wolves and the enemies of the Lord? Yeah, he did it that. You want to try it? I used to be right handy with one of these. I might even say right expert. Got another stone, son. Are you looking for me? Are you John Chess? Twelve years. I guess I am at that. Big your part, Mr. Chess. I'll bother you to dig a grave for me. Hold it. Throw it away. Now. Stop. Go turn the sheep on. I used to be faster than that. But you would have taken me even then. Twelve years. If I fell on you, I could have killed you. Well, you should have tried at that. I'm going to put chains on you, Mr. Chess. Like an animal. Like an animal. Cider. Sweet. For the ladies. Well, that'll be just fine. It ain't cold. Beer? Sure. <laughs> That's what he said. Name's Jim Park. Who? Which one of you is it? Hey, Bill, it's this one. Come on and sit down, Jimmy. He stinks a sheep. All right, Jimmy, he stinks a sheep. Now come on and sit down. What'd he do, mister? Do what your friend tells you, son. What'd you do, mister? I shot a nosy cowboy. 
Get out. You do stink up the place. Get him out of here. All right. I haven't finished my beer. You want me to drag you out of here? Finish it outside. My glory, he is strong. Don't make me kill you, neighbor. No man alive is that much faster than me. Who is he? John Chess. Ten men and a half a dozen women. Or was it ten women and half a dozen men? Get a rope, Frank. Take one more step and it cuts the cord, mister. You think he's worth dying for? Do you? Not dying. <laughs> Chuck the gun out. Chuck it out. You too. Move over with him. You. around here? No. Outside Turnby. Wouldn't go there if I were you, though. Why not? Me? His brothers? You stink of cows. You killed a prince, Mr. Tate. Brother of a king. King of this valley and everything pertaining to thereof, and that's a fact. Oh, oh now there's a dirty bullet. <sighs> In a nice, clean wound. <sighs> oh, yeah. <laughs> stoic, huh? Well, it's a man for you. Stoic. Now, if it had been a woman. Oh, you go to. Look, you have to rest for the night at least. I lay down, I won't get up for half a week. And you know it. This Abel Towie. How many men would he bring? Uh, four, five. He'll not bring an army. Just enough. Will he stop? If you kill him. I mean, can I run far enough? No. Sit down. I want a light. I said sit down. Is there something about our friend here you love? Or do you just like to talk? I don't like Towie. You see, I'm an Irishman myself, and I don't like kings. Chess, I had to kill a man because you got a bad temper and because you had to have a beer. Now, I said sit down. <laughs> a wounded man tonight? Yes, sir, Mr. Tully. One bad arm? A prisoner with him? Yes. Tell me the road they took. I don't know. We'll read the track. It'll just be slower. Did you know he'd killed my brother? I'm a doctor. Who comes to my house, I tend, Mr. Tully. 
Who giveth succor to my enemy is enemy to me. I was wondering who would deliver your wife this fall. Mr. Tolly. Burn him out. It's a house or a barn. It's bigger than a campfire and smaller than a town being sacked. You sound like you know. That's what they say. You kill all those people? Yes, sir. I massacred that town and then I burned it down. Say this for me, though. They killed my wife first. Yes. Cattle, sheep. Was it over that? They said the sheep ate the grass too short. Mr. John Chess? The air here is sweet. High from the valley. The smell of your sheep is good. Put the rifle down, son. Put it down. What's your name? Manuel Batina. Do what he says, Manuel. Can we rest here a while? What is mine is yours. last night in the valley. It was from the doctor's house. How does he know? Well, these people are all part Indian. They use smoke signals. Was the doctor hurt? No. He tried to stop them, but he was not hurt. We'll backtrack. Cover our trail. I don't want them to hurt him. and said, who gives succor to mine enemy is enemy to me, and he stinks of sheep. Back and bury him. I want their lives. In Mexico, they call the jaguar Tigrero. The natives have a saying always look behind you when you hunt a tiger.
Rest in peace. His own shovel. He had a nice smile. I liked him. Come on. You make me now. I'm not going to forget he's dead because he gave you a swig of sheep's milk. No. I liked him. He had a nice smile. And Daddy smiles like a skeleton. I killed a man who killed him, Chess. Now, if they let her rest, so will I. Why is he dead? Why did he die? Because he was a Mexican? No. Because he raped sheep? No, not even that. He's dead because you rode into his camp. You owe him a debt, gunfighter. You owe him a debt. I've paid it. Look. Give him a rifle. I never went back on my word in my life. If they don't kill me, I'll come back. I'll come back. Go to sleep, Chess. What was he? Your son, your brother, he's dead. Let him sleep. No. I want them all. You're gonna hang anyway. Make it big. I made it a big one. I took the lives of 18 human beings to pay for that of my wife. I took their lives and I sacked their homes. I even salted the earth where they'd lived so that nothing had grown for a hundred years. <laughs> I thought I could never do a thing like that again. I almost said to you, don't take me back. I'm not the man I once was. I could never do a thing like that again. I'm reformed. Give a condemned man his dying wish. Let me kill him. Let me kill him. Just what happened to your wife, Jess? Some drunken cowboys killed her. It took her two days. I think she died of shame. Turn back into the valley tomorrow. Yeah, we can move around it. He... Flatland, who'd live here? He said that. Take these off me, will you? My, my arms are tired from carrying them. Now, what difference does it make, gunfighter? It could get you shot. My funeral. It would be at that.
They've seen us. I'll take my rifle. No. You think they'll just talk on fighter? Is that it? No, they'll fight. Give me my rifle! Move back to the hill. Walk the horse. And watch the fight! That's right. What are you afraid of, gunfighter? Then I'll shoot you in the back. No, Mr. Chess. I'm just afraid you'd shoot me. Four's enough. Now walk the horse. Thank you for bringing him home. He did not like the flat lands. What are you going to do now? Tame his ship. I guess they belong to you now, huh? Then tame my ship. How old are you? Twelve years. But King David was only ten when he killed a wolf who would attack his ship. You know, I uh, really was pretty good with... Huh? 